Negus Asylum has been in Mumbai for about seven years now. And uh, we originally started out of a garage in Bandra and slowly, slowly sort of grew the community space. So the space allows us to sort of, you know, bring in that element of hardware and design along with sustainability to the table. So for example, we created something, um, it's a plastic recycling lab, basically inside an auto uh, that goes around teaching kids uh, the circular economy of plastic. So it basically has a whole extruder, uh, shredder, the whole unit of plastic recycling inside a mobile lab. And at the back end of that is a 3D printer, which shows, so if you take out a filament from here, you can put inside the 3D printer and print a different product out of a bottle that you've just shredded and, you know, sort of made. So it sort of becomes a really interesting way to visualize plastic recycling. And this has been going now in a bunch of schools in villages and remote areas, to, like serendipitous things. For example, there is this member at our space that is working on a satellite ground station which is an open source satellite ground station. And it's like a really cool project. I mean, you don't get to see something like that in other, you know. We started a campaign to, uh, uh, of donating 1000 face shields. That's what we started uh, in, in initially, where we said that, okay, there were only three of us over there. So we said that, okay, fine, we'll just make thousand because maybe thousand is something that we can do. Then uh, we decided, okay, let's just make the goal a little bit larger, make it 10,000 and then start working on it. And slowly, slowly, we started working on it, uh, on the designs and, uh, you know, started making those. We went through almost 21 design iterations in the process. We believe a lot in the open source culture and community. And that's what we decided to open source our designs on our platform. And we also open source the process of how to make it. Then a lot of people across India sort of started coming in and saying that we want to make these over here for our local community. And slowly, slowly that sort of grew into a much larger movement. And at the end of it, I think in about 49 days, we were able to make about a million shields, uh, uh, you know, with 42 cities, towns and villages sort of joining hands from different parts of the world, uh, sorry, different parts of the country and world in fact. This year we also plan to sort of uh, start a hardware accelerator uh, at Makers Asylum. Uh, but we are obviously doing a bunch of stuff. So, but soon enough, we will have something for startups as well, because at Makers Asylum organically, there have been about 25 to 30 startups that have come out of it. So we've, we've, you know, it's just, it's just the, you know, effect of the environment which exists over there. So a lot of people, a lot of small businesses come out of it. So about 25, 30 startups have come out of the space. Uh, so now we are sort of working on something interesting for them as well. Thank <laughs> you.